hey everybody welcome back to my channel welcome 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 I'm just showing you a before glimpse of my bedroom before I get started on cleaning on this particular morning I was kind of in a rush to get out the door um, getting my kids to school and then I had a few errands to run afterwards so I did not um, make up my bed. I have been in the last few months been making my bed up every morning But this particular day I was like, ah, I'll get back. You know, I'll get to it when I get back home Plus um, this is part of my weekly reset for my bedroom where I do wash my sheets um, weekly And wash my pillowcases weekly vacuum um, and I'll also clean uh, my bathroom as well but this particular morning I'm just kind of just gonna focus on the bedroom um, today and just kind of want to again show you guys my before I just wanted to add a quick tip that uh, my sister gave me so as you can see I have two windows in my bedroom but at my prior place I only had one window so instead of me buying a second set of curtain panels I just ended up splitting up just the one set of panels and just used one for each window um, these curtains are from ikea they're a part of their blackout collection but they're very heavy so i was really concerned about that and i wanted to keep a, a double curtain rod because i like the look with the sheer curtains um, behind it so um, she suggested that i just use one panel for each window and they worked out so i just wanted to kind of give that idea because sometimes curtains are expensive um, and these I think at IKEA may have been around $50 for just one set which is not bad for blackout curtains but I just wanted to give that suggestion if someone was looking to split their they have two windows but didn't want to pay the cost of two separate panels <music> Thank you. 
I just try to keep this area clean at least once a week in terms of tidiness because you know when you're in the bed you can kind of have your nightstand as a your go-to place but I try to keep that uh, pretty tidy I would say about my bed so this is one of those beds where it's just the bed frame and I put my mattress on top of it however it has a height a height where I can put like storage underneath it so with this new place I'm very limited on storage I would say that's kind of my con Okay, this is the finish um, cleaning. Also, I wanted to add, I do like home goods as well. That's another good place to shop at. But again, it just really depends on what I'm looking for. Even Hobby Lobby is another good place. So it's, I, I'll shop anywhere as long as there's a deal. But again, this is just the finishing of me um, straightening up my room. I like to vacuum, clean out, um, just clean off anything that's dusty, open up the blinds, let some natural light in, um, new sheets, new pillowcases, and just tidying up everything, making sure everything's back in its place. Cause I love just walking back into my room at the end of the day and it's everything's just all nice and tidy. Um, another, again, underneath my bed is just a lot of storage. It just helps out until I can kind of figure out a better system. But I just love just the freshness of, once everything is complete. I just hope you guys enjoyed the video. I just really appreciate um, any support and I just hope this kind of motivates you. And just like I said, just tackle one room at a time and make